What up everybody, it's Rodney Rock, and welcome to Food Poor Friday. So today I want to tell you about my absolute favorite place to get ice cream. EC in Berkeley is a small shop that serves 10 flavors every day. That includes at least one sherbet flavor and one sorbet flavor. Mary Canales was the pastry chef of world-renowned restaurant Chez Panisse for nine years. And in 2006, she decided to leave the Michelin Star Kitchen and open her very own old-fashioned ice creamery. What's great is that all the sensibilities of a Chez Panisse alumni are carried over into Mary Canales' storefront. The menu was never the same day to day. Chef Canales makes sure to incorporate the freshest ingredients at the peak of their season in order to ensure amazing flavor. Some of my must-haves that you gotta be on the lookout throughout the year are the maple bacon ice cream with its smoky but sweet flavor and she mixes in chunks of candied bacon. The Dulce de Leche has a mild caramel flavor and an otherworldly smooth texture. The vanilla creme brulee has a subtle charred flavor and has shards of glassy sugar sprinkled throughout. And my current to die for flavor is their s'more ice cream which when it's available is the best scoop of ice cream on the west coast. Yeah, said it. And it's their s'more flavor that illustrates why their ice cream is so good. Think of all the components of a s'more. You've got the chocolate, you've got the graham cracker, and you've got the charred marshmallow. Now think of having control over all of these components and making them in-house. That way you can perfectly balance all the flavors together so that in each spoonful you have the perfect s'more. Ice cream is supposed to make you happy and this makes me so happy. The ingredients that EC uses oftentimes exceed organic standards. For example, the eggs they use aren't just organic, they're pasture raised, meaning that the chickens are free to roam the land, never being cooped up in silos where they never see the light of day. Oftentimes I'll be scrolling through Twitter and I'll come across a picture of EC's flavors of the day and I'll start planning my commute so that I'll be able to hit them up before I get to my house. For those of you that make the trip out to EC and are met with the long line that is perpetually there, fear not, they have their system down pat and though the line looks long, I've never waited in it for more than 15 minutes. Their shop is tiny, so they can't fit that many people in it. Oh, and did I mention that their baked goods are amazing too? House-made brittles, marshmallows, and meringues are sold alongside their ice cream. You know, just in case there's that off chance you don't feel like eating an icy treat. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite ice cream is. As always, a thumbs up is greatly appreciated. A special shout out to Notorious Gecko for liking and leaving a comment on my last video. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate you watching and I appreciate you leaving such kind words. If you're in the area, I will leave all of Easy's information down in the description below. When you see them, tell them hi and let them know that my video got you there. Is there a special someone that you would treat to ice cream? Share this video with them. TGIF. Have a good weekend, and until next time, I'll holler at you.